know who it is. It's Chef T. And I'm actually coming with something real simple today. And simply, I'm coming with showing you guys how to properly cut a bell pepper. Um, I know a lot of people have been commenting on my videos and things like that. So I just want to bring that to y'all as a holiday special. Happy Halloween, guys. Let's get real spooky with it. So I do have a knife. This is the knife that I chose to use today. You can use any size knife that you want. This is just a basic chef knife. This is a basic knife that we usually use. So, um, yeah, I want to show you guys other knives that you can come and use. They're smaller ones. I don't have to use a big one. Y'all can use a smaller one, some small like this. That's fine. You just do the same exact thing that I'm doing. This is just a knife that I'm choosing to use. Uh, so this is a, of course, green bell pepper. And this green pepper is a great access to my Trinity, which I use a lot in my Cajun and Creole cooking. So... Let me show you guys the easy, simple way that I do it. So this is the top of it. This is how you pull it from out the plant when you do it. So this is the top of it. This is the bottom of it, right? So I like to cut the top half Fill out the top half. And go over it again one more. Fill in. I do save all my innings for my stocks. Y'all, please pay attention to one of those videos. I will tag it to this. But to learn how to make a homemade stock, it's good to use all the innings. Just as so. And put it to the side because we're going to use that later. So when I do that, I like to take this end of the knife, the back half of it, and go through as I do so. And then I take it and go all the way around just as so. And as you're going around, you actually see that ending that you're cutting off. So you guys know that when you cut a bell pepper, or if you don't know, we're about to learn now, you wanna take all that white flesh off, but that green you wanna keep. And I try to cut off as much green as I can to keep, I'm gonna keep that to the side also. Just take that and pop that out. See how that goes off? If it breaks, that's fine, don't even trip. You just basically go back in with your knife. Flat, if you need to put that down flat, you can, and you just wanna go across, flat and across, just to get that white meat and flesh off of this. Take that again, put it to the side. And again, we're just gonna go and get that white flesh off. So we got the knife real flat against the meat. And see how I move my fingers out the way? And then I come back. I wanna hold it so that it doesn't slip and move out, right? And look, there we go. And then we're gonna come in. And get some strips out of it. This is exactly what I'm doing for my recipe later, so I'm not gonna cut it from there, but we cut it from there and go into dices. So, it's my strips. And there we have it, our bell pepper. Happy Halloween, guys.